welcome to part two of the Orion Conspiracy. Uh, let's keep going with this. Hopefully we can find out the, uh, the identity of our son's murderer? Probably not in part two. But you don't know. Maybe uh, it's a short game. I, I do. I played it. I just... <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Touche. Poking out holes in your, uh... In my, yeah. Yeah. Well, all right. Let's go. All right, with those people talk to, uh, we're off to somewhere random. I kind of like how we do have a bit of the entertainment. Oh god, <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I really hope we leave her for the entire game, just waiting for this freaking basketball game. I, I, I can't oh, get oh, out. Oh no! Oh, she's still watching me. Oh. <laughs> Oh, there I go. Oh. There, but for the- Thank, thank god I, I escaped. I did it. I'm gonna see that basketball in my nightmares tonight. <laughs> it's far more traumatizing than the death of my son. Well, you know. The, the sucky thing about pre-recording is sometimes I have to sit and remember uh, what I was doing at this point. <laughs> Every time the screen goes black, I have to expect the video to just stop. It's a little, uh... A jarring. Yeah. yeah. I kind of wish that they could have seamlessly transitioned a bit more. But 1995 technology. Yeah. Do they... you like the CD loading screen? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fancy. Pretty nostalgic, eh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ooh, a slightly different background. Oh, it, oh, it, oh, oh, there, oh, there, there you go. go. <laughs> Apparently exiting a room was a little hard we'll to stop figure. commenting on it once the stuff's being funny. Yeah. <laughs> Which is never. <laughs> so when I said there were a lot of hallways, uh, I think Holy a lot shit. of the game is traveling. <laughs> it is a space station, so there's probably a lot of stuff, but... I, I guess, yeah. If it gets too annoying, let me know and I will <laughs> fast forward. <laughs> I do kind of wish that there was maybe more to discern each hallway from each other. If, even if like the basic structure of the hallway was the same, if there was maybe a little more decorative elements. Like, if these people are living here for, the elevator doors. for who, who knows how long. Yeah, they'd probably go stir crazy. Yeah, I mean, they probably would decorate I just things want or... to see some wallpaper. <laughs> <laughs> maybe a coat of paint. Well, you know, something. Nice potted plant. You know, photo of my dead son. You know, spice up the place. So you can see there uh, that there's no elevator D on uh, level one. Mm -hmm. So we have to go to level two to get on the D elevator. Yeah, kind of had to do a bit of a crisscross. Yeah, and now we're in uh, level D3. <laughs> so there you go. That's uh, that's that. All right. <laughs> And I realized pretty quickly that was not where I needed to be. Uh, oh. Well, yep, yeah, that was just a bit of a tease. <laughs> you know. A little preview for... I just, uh, just want to keep people interested. Yeah. And so this is actually the shuttle we came in on. Oh. Yeah. Down there what? Is we the just walked through a door and we're in a spaceship? Well. Another spaceship? A shuttle, yeah. Well, it has to dock That's somewhere. But like, I mean, we just went in one door and just popped out here. Like, no. you'd think there'd be some sort of, like, transition? I don't it's criticize your spaceship. Computer console. <laughs> if I well, could uh, just I guess you're technically right. <laughs> might be able to stick long so our to goal here is to give ourselves or give ourselves more time, because originally we were going to fly out in the morning. So we're going to sabotage our spaceship so that we have to stay. Look, we love our son. This is why people think... We're crazy. It'll we love our son. Accessing navigation but like, we... At this point, Look, we don't... Look, it's only crazy if we get caught. I had somebody slipped a mysterious letter under my door and said my son was murdered, and I just <laughs> went with it. That's Wait. why I killed all these people. That gives me access to the <laughs> No, they're, he's not computer. sabotaging it so it will kill people. Well, he's still sabotaging it. Like, that's still... I'm pretty sure that's probably yeah. Look, all he's clearing doing is the clearing the memory, memory banks. Find me the time I need to find out what's been that's happening. No, minor there. inconvenience. It's fine. It's... You're still... You're not... Uh, I mean... Uh, <laughs> racist Mitch... Dude's gonna be Where all up in you? a business. I was now. all set to slam dunk you into some. <laughs> <shit. laughs> 
Sorry, I She's so you. bad. Well, you're a bit early to be returned to the Kashiro. I'm just about to run the pre-flight checks. Ah, uh, convenient. Oh, for some reason, mysteriously, all the memory is gone. Who, oh, well, who could have done this? Uh, probably not the guy who was in here before. Fun. Probably not the guy who distracted me for 15 hours. Oh, Christ, will you look at this? The Navcom's been erased. Ah, inexplicable. Really? How off? <laughs> what does that mean, exactly? It means I can't fly you anywhere oh, until God. we get a replacement. And the earliest that that'll be is when the next supply ship comes. One week from now. Okay. Oh, no, I have to Looks stay like here a whole here week. Oh, no. Well, I guess maybe we'll play basketball tomorrow. And she runs <laughs> off excited. She gets back in her little jersey thing again. And then she <laughs> she just, like, stands there the entire night. At one Wait. point, falling asleep, standing up, <laughs> dreaming of that basketball match. I'll show him. Well, I mean, probably they don't get to do a lot of fun things. And they have to stay with the same people all the time. So. <laughs> yes. She's just so desperate. No, but maybe nobody plays basketball except for her. Oh, no, I'm sad. I mean, you'd think you'd just get a different sport or something. But I guess nothing can nothing can capture the magic of basketball. Uh, basketball forever. Basketball in my dreams. Basketball is life. Basketball. There are the is doors now. to the elevator. <laughs> Why do you you keep clicking on the elevator? I doors? yeah, I keep thinking it's the way to get to break the elevator open. Well, I mean, you would kind of think that you would get in the elevator and then select the uh, yeah. That's more what I was thinking, but apparently no. And not in the future. No. That's far too efficient. Yeah, gotta do it backwards. I also like how the elevator is a black hole, much like the one that killed our son. <laughs> ah, black holes everywhere. Wow, oh, so oh. many bad memories. <laughs> So this, uh, this is, load, this is the map <laughs> where uh, our son used to work. Okay. Did you kill my son? You're one of the technicians, aren't you? I like how we kind of wiggle our arms I'm when we're talking. Technician. Well, so you were, we're, Danny's we're boss. expressive talkers. Yes. I was devastated. It's sort of like we're happened. ants, and those are our, the antennae, and they kind of waggle what back and forth job? to, like, talk to each I'm other. Yeah. Technicians here, Just like ants. The Kobayashi ones, anyway. <laughs> I coordinate research and liaise with the captain to get what we need for our work. So can you explain to me why my son uh, was in a putt-putt? <laughs> What's it like to work here? Let's put it this way. If I'd known what I was letting myself in for when I took the promotion, I would have quite happily stayed at C7 Pay for the rest of my oh, career. So quit your job! No amount of money is worth the grief I get working no. for. No! Quit your job! No, no. Sometimes uh, getting to complain is worth everything. I guess. It makes it all feel better. Yeah. I was too happy at my old job, so I'm kind of glad I got this new one that I What's can complain so bad about. about working uh, here? Just passing through, guys. Where do I start? The secrecy, the politics, the corporate the bullshit? The weekly murders? Not to mention some of the assholes I have to work with. I like that one dude in the background just kind of dipping his hand into the, uh, Who gives you the chamber there. Well, the racism from that redneck ward I can just ignore. It's a shame that any like, witty uh, retort you fire she back goes same straight over his thick head. As, uh, Brooks? No. Yeah. The real well, shit they both kind of have the Rover. same accent. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. I was, I was too fixated on the guy in the background that was paying attention. Uh, by uh, the by, just for interest's sake, uh, guess who Roland is? He's lazy, uh, is it the dude devious, in the back? Yep. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> we're just talking shit about him right in front of him. That's and it's gotta be pretty loud, considering how far apart we're standing. Well, we're literally, like, we're like two feet in front of Roland. <laughs> yep. That's a... Awesome. What is Maybe he has life? an iPod in or something. <laughs> nice safe posting in the home quadrant for Maybe your job years. wouldn't be so shitty if you stopped talking shit me, about like all your employees. Well, well maybe you just wait till you meet Roland uh, before uh, judging her like too harshly. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> so, basically, no uh, the theme of a lot of the crew members what is that husband? they are uh, he got somewhat so cranky. Being yeah, I, I gathered. Except for Chandra. 
Prince John River is and pretty you nice. Know yeah. what happens Everybody to that. is either pissed off at somebody or they're pissing someone off. So the implication there is that a company killed her husband. How okay. well did you know that? Or ex-husband. Yeah. He was a conscientious worker, enthusiastic, friendly, good team player. Yeah, so it seems like everyone really liked our son. Yeah. Work with most of the time. Um yeah. He was with me and Roland researching the Whoa. Orion effect. Mmm, that's almost the title of the ah, significant <gasps> Oh god. <laughs> What's the Orion effect? I, I want to be in the past. <laughs> yeah. It's only the biggest astronomical event since the Denebola Oh yes, supernova. the Denebola supernova. I remember it well. <laughs> I've been <laughs> preoccupied. Could you recap for me? Okay, <laughs> let's see. Do you know the horses uh, had nothing? Uh, no. See from Earth. Uh, horses. It's in the can, constellation. Can you tell me what those are? Yeah, quarter horses. five, isn't it? Should be near here. It is here. Or at least it was, until Devil's oh. Gate appeared. The black hole? Oh. You're saying it sucked a whole nebula in? That's a pretty strong yeah, black wasn't hole. Detected long Why were you letting your, your people go on spacewalks with Jesus. the black hole sucking Galileo full nebulas in? They were researching it. Around at the question <laughs> mark. Yes, he could. Well, there's got to be a better way to research Wait, a black hole than by tiptoeing around it. It was never on my yeah, star fly charts. right into it. I, I guess, maybe if you just go really ago, fast, you'll come out the other side. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, this black it hole, yeah. 12 years ago, just mm. before the end of the Corporation War. Significance? Black holes don't and just turns appear out, out of we nowhere. We created a gun this that fires did. black holes. <laughs> The Orion. We don't know why. It turns out it was a pretty shitty idea. I mean, it looked pretty cool, though. <laughs> I mean, we kind of blew up Danny's the sun, death. but, you know, <laughs> it was worth it. I mean, we're all dying, <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, it's pretty sweet way to go. Day, yeah, you know, Black it was Hogan. down to me sweet. to ensure his safety. You killed my son, then! <laughs> <laughs> oh. How do you think it happened? Well... The controls uh, of the scout were rendered shot. inoperable. Mm. The only thing that could do that would be an so energy sure. surge. So when we open the door, presumably do that's when the energy surge will be hit us? Possibly. We're time. gonna get more information on that a little bit later. Hmm. I can look them up for you. Okay. <laughs> that's very polite. Oh, I'm done. Three megawatt flare. Search results are super fast in the future. Not the black oh, hole. Yeah. Wouldn't you have checked, maybe? What could give before? Off that yeah, that also seems uh, kind of dumb. Uh, so how did my son die? Uh, we didn't really put any effort into finding out. I mean, we had some floating off, so we assumed <laughs> that you know, <laughs> probably an accident. <laughs> At the end of the day. It was down to me to ensure his safety. I don't know why uh, you can repeat that option there. Just to hit home the, the pathos. Possibly. What do you know about Magami Hudson? The company specializes Where, uh, in geology. It used to be the Hudson's Bay we Company. Don't have <laughs> <that's> <laughs> sharing, so that's a lie. They're near death as it is in 2016. <laughs> Canada jokes. <laughs> oh, that was nice great. Enough. Any time. Uh, bye, I guess. <laughs> uh. <laughs> bye, and she just shuffles off to the side. Well, let's talk to Roland. Oh, uh, the pinnacle of human existence here. Oh, did you hear Try my boss talking shit about chocolate on you? Oh, no. Uh, sorry, I'm right out. Damn. I already used up my allowance for this week. Damn. Um, all right. What is your job? I'm primarily an electronics engineer. But I get roped into doing all sorts of mundane stuff. <laughs> this isn't what I study. Kind of sounds like the same voice actor who did Ray in the real Ghostbusters. In <laughs> Doesn't it though? I got a trade to have. Production line. <laughs> <laughs> I like the sound effect of the door punctuating that last sentence. Yeah, there. I don't. Whatever, whatever, ruined. I'm the coolest. <laughs> door Do, shut. Do you have any chocolate on you? And you can chocolate. 
Yeah. What's it like to work I'm drawn slightly fat, so that must mean that I like this eating. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm working for Lucifer. Bernard is a working for bitch. Lucifer? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, she's right over there. Well, These I mean, two clearly they, don't give a enough. shit. If they this just didn't talk me. shit about each other <laughs> in front of the other. She'll be the death of me. Uh, she like makes me work and stuff. What a bitch. Yeah, yeah, she's such a bitch. I heard that, Roland. I hate you too. I hate what you too. <laughs> Before I was forced to get a job. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Hmm. I murdered Danny. What? Oh. <laughs> How well did you know Danny? I didn't have anything against him personally. Physically, though. I let people live their lives. <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 what do you know about Danny's death? Don't blame me. <laughs> I had nothing to do with it. Suspicious. Suspicious <laughs> or just narcissistic? <laughs> Everything that happens here is unusual. We're I can't think of any space. place I'd rather be. <laughs> Isn't this wacky? <laughs> what do you know about Magami Hudson? They have no vices. They show no they emotion. They only talk it all the time, work. like me. It's weird they don't even bitch each other out all the time. I can't understand it. Like, they don't take really sick days or, or stand here they with don't, their, they their don't hands and things. They don't call each other it's racist mine. things or, like, call each other bitch or bastard. It's weird. It's like they have respect for each other. <laughs> totally strange. I don't trust him at all. <laughs> Yeah, so out of all the people we've met, Burke seems alright. Um, she's got a weird obsession with basketball. <laughs> uh, Chandra also seems alright, but based on everyone else in the ship is probably a serial murderer or something. Yeah, yeah. Like, these are not pleasant people to be stuck uh, with for a week. Well, I feel like if you were on a spaceship uh, all the time forever, you'd maybe be a little cranky too. I, I guess, but like... We'll talk to that guy someday. Maybe he's oh, nice. Oh, he's like, oh, will we? I don't know. Oh, oh I got excited. It's a big world. I got too excited <laughs> for a minute to prospect of talking to someone who's not a dickhead. <laughs> well, we haven't talked to him yet. We don't know. Yeah. It's alright. It's alright. Uh, so we're now investigating, uh charges so basically finding out what could have done oh, a yeah, big giant charge yeah spooked our son yeah mm -hmm. well not spooked uh <laughs> well i mean it probably spooked him <laughs> <laughs> so here's a tram to oh. another part of a station all right yep that's uh in the future uh trams are pretty slow we might as well have just had another long ass hallway uh yep yep uh but you know all right uh Effort in where, uh, where it counts. Hmm. <laughs> you tried. Feature. And uh, now we're in. Uh, you'll never guess where where we are. It's uh, a hallway. It, it, uh, you oh, spoiled it. Oh, I did, oh, oh, the captain just. Uh, not the Kobayashi captain. Oh, oh is this you the other the people's captain? Mogami Hudson. Yeah. Why are there two captains? Because yes, there's two I companies. Did they fight? Company. Like who's like top captain? I don't know, probably Kobayashi, because there's more of us. <laughs> I'm responsible Just like for the Canada, Magami we're Hudson bigger and on top. <laughs> Canada jokes. <laughs> What's it like to work here? <laughs> working for Megami Hudson is different to working for well, Kobayashi. Maybe. You could never understand. You sound really suspicious. <laughs> that was a non-answer, though. What he needed to be, background? like, sipping a glass of wine while doing that line. I've Perhaps petting Gami a fluffy Hudson cat. Yeah. That's all I'm I would die for, for it. <laughs> I would kill for it. If I have killed for it. Oh, I said too much. <laughs> How well did Not your you son, though. Danny. Just some random guy that you don't know. Some random guy named Danny. <laughs> oh, that was my son's name. Oh, no, <laughs> I've said too much again. <laughs> What do you know about Danny's death? It was nothing to do with us. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> Did well, uh, I, I didn't we don't know. need to waste time <laughs> talking to you anymore. Death. I didn't launch a flare that caused your son to fly off into a black nothing hole. What are you talking about? <laughs> under my command, Kobayashi has its own problems. 
Mm, Megami Hudson is basically Can I see your laboratory? <laughs> it's a restricted area. <laughs> Only yeah, which employees can enter. Make, would make sense. I don't know why we were able to wander around the Kobayashi side so freely. I gotta be going now. Um, yeah. I, eh. <laughs> Just I don't have a good answer for that one. Yeah. Troubles, Mr. McCormack. Stop uh, bringing your dead son into every conversation. <laughs> er, right, your son died. Just get it's over it already. God. <laughs> or whatever. Oh, that's awesome. He's Fine, like, fuck you. I, do, like, I don't care. Just if... you want to go play basketball? <laughs> no. Oh, oh, I was too smart for that. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was all my tricks. Yeah, I did my one trick. <laughs> that's what got me through the war. Just bouncing a basketball on the field and then see who. Anyone want to play? Oh, oh, shoot some hoops. You. All right, Come sweet. On. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Space Jam. <laughs> oh, this guy was at- No, come back! You were at the funeral, too! Yep. Let's just pick up this extinguisher and, oh, uh... Oh, god. Yep. I just think... right- Oh, right in the coat. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Uh, what's that bulge under your coat? Uh, nothing? <laughs> <laughs> you just hear the big clang of metal. Uh, I have a pacemaker. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, the pacemaker's currently shooting uh, fluid. Um, you know, that's just that. I should probably. Uh, I'm gonna go to the doctor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be right back. So uh, I just went in to talk to this dude, and he's not here. Switches. Though he was he's in here. Probably ducking behind something. He saw you coming. Yeah, I don't want to talk to that guy. I'm gonna mm. talk to his dead son. <laughs> and uh. Oh, he's there. No, uh, oh, oh, oh wait, no. Oh, come back. <laughs> Chase him around so much, man. Oh I just my god. Want to have a conversation. He... Oh, good. Oh, we did it. Oh. Oh, that's my. Oh, this was the uh, guy that uh, Ward was uh, crapping on. Hey, yeah. Excuse me. What do you want? I got work to do. Uh, wow. Uh, just. Do you want to make conversation for five minutes? What is your uh, job? No, what is your job? <laughs> I keep this hunk of rock where it is instead of going down the plug hole. <laughs> I'm the only one here right, who knows right, Jack shit about for my son, maybe. Yeah. So, <laughs> Would have been nice. Go Thanks. Every damn thing that goes wrong. The engines, life support, equipment maintenance, <laughs> if it's broke. I so continuing it. with the theme, uh, this guy also does not like anything. No. These sad life everyone leads on this ship. Mm-hmm. God. I, it's sort of it's sort of sad to think that in the in the future that we might be so used to being in space that the very fact that we are existing in space is no longer enough to fill us with joy. Yep. Well, I mean, and, and I love space here? conceptually, but it also like it's, it's space. There's it's not shit. a lot out there. What's but it you like to go float? Asking dumbass questions. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Oh shit. I don't think they're dumb. <laughs> what is your back? It's just like, what well, we are moving on. I, I really appreciate I when we're doing a, a dialogue thing like this. So as I end up and um, like the other we just continually the ended, piss off the people we're talking to, and yet we can just continue the conversation. Oh, record, yeah. Mm. All right, we're going to say the F word in our game a lot. Yeah. Fuck this and fuck mm. that. So he refused a promotion and in return he got to be the repairman on a crappy ship. Yep. Well, station at this point. Well, eh. How Dear well God, did what you are those know things Danny? in the front? I assume giant canisters of something that is extremely flammable. Without being too crude, they kind of look like himself. giant dildos go, on the right. Never had to speak to him. Don't they? You can't unsee it now. Well, it's a cylinder, and like any cylindrical object could probably be a, like a penis. But on the right, on the right. I'm seeing him. I'm, yeah. I'm just saying that it's a cylinder. You just don't understand. What do you I, do about don't, I guess not. <laughs> If there had been a problem uh, well, on the scout, just... I would have fixed it. But no one reported <laughs> anything. Not my problem, then. Yeah, not me. I'm too perfect for that. Although, really, if there was a problem and uh, no one reported it, I'd be right pissed. Mm -hmm. Oh god, look how many questions we have left. It's so many questions. <laughs> Oh, 
You're thinking really hard about what to I'm choose next. I'm thinking really hard. Did anything on you? Oh, there we go. Before <laughs> that is death. The captain had me well, up on Well, he left me the suicide note. Uh, I don't like living anymore. I'm going to go in a black hole. <laughs> yeah. I like to think that he's the black hole. He's like a portal to another Miami dimension, Hudson. and he's hanging out. You know. Yeah. He is. I was having a good life. I know I don't like them. Maybe. But they're so personable. Why don't hmm. you like Miami Hudson? <laughs> He's mad. <laughs> How can you not like them? They're so nice. How dare you? Oh, yeah. Piece of paper that says they're our friends now. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. So that is the war that uh, Devlin also yeah. fought in. Which it's kind of weird then that he doesn't know why we they don't like them. Well, he explains it a little bit. Okay. As soon as his uh, text decides that it's finished being on screen. Mm -hmm. There were yeah, lots of sides in the war. Even Kobayashi changed allegiances, sometimes halfway through a battle. There was no real enemy. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, he seems to have a more practical yeah. uh, view of the war. Yeah. At least it, uh, as far it as it seems. It was them or us. Hell, you should realize that. You were in the thick of it, I hear. You got hurt, right? Yes, tell me all about your war injuries. I'm sure it's a topic you love to go into. No, I tell them in depth about all the pain yeah, and but suffering. I didn't hurt anybody else. Mm -hmm. And I don't I mean, blame I'm a total stranger, so I probably understand better than anyone really. else. <laughs> hmm. He's got he's got a healthy opinion to it. Yeah. Although uh, it's mentioned that uh, yeah, right. before the game started, he did have a lot of uh, PTSD. Oh, okay, so it's uh, presumably, I mean, he's older now. He's maybe at a at a stage um, you know any weapon that could give off where he's kind of worked through it. Eating. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess that uh, the PS. Uh, the PTSD was uh, sort of what thing I know made of life really hard for them oh, and sort of that's drove why. Danny away. Oh. And, yeah. Hmm. Unfortunate. Uh, I believe it was also mentioned that he, uh, because of an injury he sustained during the war, uh, he was not able to work and in a society that's so corporation-based, it was a big shame. Bitches. And mm. Yeah. Hmm. So a lot of bad stuff. Yeah. Do you have any close friends on Cerberus? <laughs> do you have any friends? Can I Strangely be your enough, friend? No, I fucking do not. <laughs> <laughs> he talks like me. I know, right? I feel like I need to swear more. I have to go now. Fucking swear more. Fuck you. Uh, 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 well, uh, <laughs> it was lovely talking to you, I, I guess. Uh, sorry I took up 30 minutes of your workday to talk about nothing. Yeah. No wonder you're cranky all the time. Yeah. Well, uh, bye. <laughs> well, um, hope you don't notice the fire extinguisher I stole uh, from you. Probably you don't need it. And then something sets on fire. Yeah, and, oh, don't worry, I got a fire extinguisher. Oh, where'd it go? No! <laughs> <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Only Danny could have had a fire extinguisher and he wouldn't have died. He could have used it to propel himself <laughs> back towards the station once he started drifting towards the back hole. The only problem with that plan is there's no oxygen in space. Well, that doesn't matter with a fire extinguisher. Anyways, uh, <laughs> that was part two. All right. Uh, we'll be back uh, next time with part four. Just kidding, part three. <laughs> Yeah, threw a little plot uh, twist in there for you. Uh, I'm spooked. Ooh. Ooh. Take care, guys. <laughs>